Police officers traded in their badges for capes to bring smiles to some patients at Stony Brook University Children's Hospital today. Some of those children are facing the fact that they'll have to spend the holidays away from home. CBS 2's Jessica Layton reports. Holiday cheer spread far and wide at the Suffolk County Hospital, where patients in four children's units got special presents, plus a surprise visit from two superheroes, Captain America and Captain Marvel. We wanted to bring you a little something for the holidays. Twelve-year-old Anthony Velez may have just had his appendix removed, but he was all smiles holding his brand new Lego set. It's good to me and my little brother can... Yeah. Build it together. Just down the hall, 14 year old David Balderas is in the midst of a serious battle with brain cancer. I'm feeling way better, but now my hair is gone. Because my hair, I had more hair, but now I don't have hair anymore. Regardless, Baldera says his spirits are higher, and now so is his excitement to play a new board game. I like Monopoly. The presents were purchased by Suffolk County Police Department's nonprofit organization, Cops Who Care. It's an annual event aiming to put a smile on every patient's face and make these tough times a little easier. If we could just bring any child, just one child, any amount of joy or happiness during this time when they're here in the hospital and sick, it's something we love to do. To get a gift, to uplift some spirits and, and meet an officer, not only in uniform but in costume, is what it's all about. The officers say it's important to remember giving back is a crucial part of the holiday season and they will continue to surprise children for years to come. Jessica Layton, CBS 2 News. Wishing those children the best.